okay so let's say someone rent on your website a customer went on your website they saw a form they contact you and they place an order say like hey i want to order five of this five of this five of this or they say hey i want to use your service that that um it's important that when they do that when they place an order on your website or through email or whatever that you send them a feed feedback or reply like a thank you mail so thank you for your order so we're going to focus on what you can put in that situation so thank you for your order what you can put in that situation so i have a dream that's all i need i did something wrong let me do it again i press four i have a dream that's all i need i see I see I made a mistake with uh, with OBS. Give me one second. I put a hotkey in and the hotkey is important for something else. So let me remove all the hotkeys. Because if I use them here and OBS, it means that it will collide. So that means that it's not good. Okay. If I'm correct, it should be fine right now. Yeah okay sorry let's start all over again yeah sorry about that okay um we should go to scene so you guys can see what i'm seeing right now so i'm gonna start all over again and then um yeah the thing is um i put some hotkeys on obs and those obs as the same house key with the uh, trying apps that i'm using and now they collide with each other and the problem with that is that i cannot use them well so um yeah let's do it again so let's say you have a company and in that company you have um it's your company someone came to the company and they place an order and after they place an order you want to send them an email like a thank you email thank you for your order so in this video we're going to talk about the email what you can put into it i'm going to write a uh, template so you can use it and if you have question about it let me know remember you can use this for uh, when someone plays an order on a website or when someone has uh, placed an order on an email doesn't matter as long as you send a reply so what can you put into it remember this is a template you can change it however you want so you can use it and if you see something that you can use pause the video read it write it down and uh, use it and if you have question about it just go in the discord just go in the law center and the law center you can ask me question about this so this is the blank plate what we are going to discuss and we're going to start first with the subject so let's create it 24 subject and we're gonna put it thank you for your order that's a good one All right so we create that and yeah i'm gonna write the letter down and then i'll tell you what i did and what i didn't so let's have a dear and put the contact name that's important yeah so the name the name of the person the name of the client doesn't matter it's important you put it so let's start with the first one okay so let's say you are starting out and someone place an order for the first time and uh, you can send them this you can start with this say thank you for your order of and then the numbers of the products so if they order let's say 10 20 or 500 you put it and then you can tell them why um why they should be satisfied so i believe you will be very satisfied with the quality of our products it is this quality that makes our company apart from competition so you can put something like this in your letter doesn't have to be exactly like this you can change it over however you want so we're going to write the second one second paragraph 
So. Okay, so we finished the letter and then uh, let's get to the signature and then I'm going to discuss the letter with you so you get the general idea why we put certain kind of things in the letter. So here, like we said, we always get the signature. You can make signature however you want. So we always get the signature from the previous letter. But here we can say, this is something you can say. You don't have to. Yeah, This is a way how you can use this in order to upsell. What I mean by that is you send them the order, make sure everything is fine. And then you contact them that again and see if they need more and then you sell more. So that's what people call upsells. Yeah. Not directly after the order, but uh, yeah, you can use it. So if you look at here, we have, as we discussed, I will be shipping number of description of products. So how much you're going to ship to be received no later when Will, will they receive the, the products? I will be contacting you the week of date. So in the week to determine of if the additional quantity is needed. If you need to place an order before then please call me at the number below. So here you put your phone number and let them call you and then if they have question and that's it. So technically this is like a thank you letter that you send to the people. And yeah, if I were you, I would just use it. And if you think, okay, I need to change it yeah change it change it however you want and uh, use it make sure you thank those people when they place an order it can be a product or services doesn't matter make sure you do that it can also be one paragraph like the first part you don't have to use the second part but the second part is a way how you can talk to the people and try to upsell them so if you have question about it just go to the link which you see down below on this link you will find um, the Matis Legal Law Center and in the Law Center you can ask questions about these things. So if you have questions, let me know and I'll see you guys in the next video. I have a dream, that's all I need. I'll make it up with some work and belief. Know what I want, so I'll take it on. I've made mistakes, but mistakes make you strong. Let's break it down for a minute. I want the crown, I'm gonna get it. You hear me lament, I'm winning, yeah, Charlie Sheen will be great.